Welcome to Flourish, a springtime meditation series where we watch new life begin around us and we plant the seeds in our lives to live like Jesus. We nourish these seeds and grow flowers that flourish. Find a comfortable position to begin your meditation. Taking a deep breath in and letting the muscles in the body relax on the exhales. Take another breath like this. Closing the eyes this time with your breath out. Let the breath return to its natural state now. And begin to scan the mind's attention through the body. Starting at the top of the head and moving down the body in your own time. Simply becoming aware of what you are feeling in this present moment. Not changing anything about what is present, just isolating each body part at a time to give your awareness undivided focus. Move the awareness down the body in your own time now. At any time, if you feel that the mind has gotten distracted, exhale the distraction away, returning to where you left off and continuing with compassion. and coming back together here in a short moment. In this focused and grounded state, we now consider and build the foundation for what we want to cultivate over the next six weeks and beyond. We aim to emulate the way that Jesus lived in our own lives. When we think about the qualities of Jesus, we think of things like service, humility, dedication, grace, compassion, self-control, among many others. When you look around at your life, What quality or qualities do you want to grow and nourish this spring?
With that quality in mind, we consider the foundation that we have to build in order to start our garden. Today we build the raised garden bed. What habits, relationships, actions, and conversations do you have to put in place in your life to begin to develop this quality? As you reflect on this foundation, consider realistically, what do you have the power to change and what do you not have control over and need to ask for grace? How will you use this knowledge to build your foundation? And as we consider the foundation that we are building, we are reminded that this must be built in Jesus. For in this, we find the highest quality of wood that we can use to build our bed. We read Matthew chapter 7 verses 24 through 27 together, repeating the verse to yourself as it is read, praying over it or even pausing the video to journal. Anyone who listens to my teaching and follows it is wise, like a person who builds a house on solid rock. Though the rain comes in torrents, and the flood waters rise, and the winds beat against that house, It won't collapse because it is built on bedrock. But anyone who hears my teaching and doesn't obey it is foolish, like a person who builds a house on sand. When the rains and floods come and the winds beat against that house, it will collapse with a mighty crash. We respond in prayer together. Jesus, we know that the rain, floods, and wind will come and try to tear our foundation down. And so we choose to build our foundation upon your teachings and examples. With you, we know that we will have a foundation that stands the test of time. We thank you for your example and your guidance. Walk with us as we try to emulate the life you lived this season. We thank you, God, for your grace and for your mercy. And finish your prayer with the things on your heart today. When you are ready, begin to deepen the breath, bringing the awareness back to the present, back to what the breath sounds like. Back to what the body is feeling. Begin to make small movements, coming out of stillness slowly.
On your next inhale, open the eyes. As your day continues, find moments to inhale your chosen quality and exhale fear. 